All right, so it's no surprise that Tradelands has a really unique player base. You come across all these different brands of people every day, it seems. It's kind of endearing seeing how a game has brought together a bunch of people, at least in my opinion. However, I have to address an issue that I've observed for a long while now. There's one corner of the player base that I find completely fucking unbearable. The quirky poor people. I might glow. Hey, buy you, that. you should buy my glow. Give Werner. I, I think that'd be real poor. cool. Augers. I might glowy. Your sledgehammer is worth more than my entire network. Gib hey, 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 hey. Can I have you your 20k bounty, please? I stuff. really need Gib it. Give cape. Give Werner. You know, it'd be real funny. If you bought my glowies. Gib All right. I know that this comes off as a little mean spirited and petty, but trust me, once you start seeing this shit everywhere just as much as I do, you'll get just as fucking annoyed. Allow me to explain my point of view. It might help you understand better. I am a cargo trader. A cargo trader in 2021 trade lands. I have always been a cargo trader since the days of Verdantine or whatever. I can confidently sit and say that around 90% of the things that I have purchased myself were bought with nothing but cargo money. Okay, so with that thought in mind, let's continue. I am so fucking sick and tired and fed up with this trend in trade lands where players decide to go around and constantly remind everybody that they're poor and that you should buy their shitty glowies so that they can stop being poor. Now it's worth mentioning where the quirky part comes from. You see, these players often try to paint their virtual poverty in a funny, almost ironic way. They're usually like, sorry, I'm money hungry. That's why my shit's overpriced. Basically the trade lands equivalent of the white girls going around blaming their annoying personalities on their zodiac signs. Yeah, I'm poor and being a little about it. Tee hee, just being a Virgo. Pain. Listen, I, of all people, fucking understand how hard it is to make a decent living in the inflated economy of trade lands today. So I don't need your broke ass reminding me. Want money? Work for it. Smack rocks with the pickaxe and sell the materials or move boxes or steal boxes or do both at the same time. My God, quit f***ing going around trying to sell your shitty glowies. If you made a post and trade and nobody hit you up about it, it's probably because there's no demand for the shit that you're selling. Like, I knew this one dude who would join my VC every day just to say some dumb shit like, hey, hey, bread, you should buy my... And he'd always say it like that too. You should buy this. You should buy that. And I'd be like, why should I? And then he'd just say some dumb shit like, because it'd be cool, or it'll be so poggers. Ah, <laughs> so fucking funny. No. I can also recall another experience with one of those vermin a while back where I was talking about the possibility of me quitting Tradeland because I was having problems balancing gaming and schoolwork. And unbeknownst to me, one of those fucking gremlins snuck their way into the VC and interrupted me saying, Brad, you should quit the game and give me all your stuff so I could sell it. That'd be cool. And then he proceeded to ask me if I wanted to buy a shitty glowies. Now do you see it? Do you understand the frustration and the bullshit now? Yeah, there's a bunch of ways to make money in the game. And yeah, some ways are obviously more time efficient than others, but you aren't going to make money by saying that you're poor. It's cringe, it's dumb, and there's nothing to laugh about. Broke people should never laugh! All right, well, I think my job's pretty much done here now that I've established and proposed a solution to the current problem amidst the trade lands community. I think it's also worth noting that the quirky poor people demographic in trade lands is mostly made up of players on the younger side of the community, so take that with a grain of salt, I guess. Either way, in conclusion, work towards your goals and you'll get there eventually. Nobody gives a shit if you're broke. Goodbye.